three organizations are suing the city of Tucson, alleging they planned major homeless encampment sweeps ahead of the Gem and Mineral Show. Now, the lawsuit is asking the court to prevent future sweeps and to prevent police from enforcing city or, or ordinances criminalizing homelessness. Nine on your side's Faith Abercrombie spoke to one of those organizations as well as the city about how the community should handle Tucson's unhoused population. We weren't able to get the hearing and the injunction in time. It was pushed over and while that happened, the city continued to, the city made the sweep and not just at Santa Rita, but in the um, general area. Zara Olivier with the People's Defense Initiative is from one of the three organizations that says the city is clearing homeless encampments to hide them from public view. It's just this constant moving of people without actually addressing the issues. The city of Tucson responded to the lawsuit with a statement that read in part, the allegation in the complaint is untrue. City enforcement actions are based on established protocols that prioritize enforcement based on the threat to public safety. The lawsuit states there are more houseless individuals than shelter beds. Kega 9 reached out to the city for an update on the lawsuit, but they responded no comment about the litigation as it is ongoing. The city of Tucson referred to their tier system showing their protocol online. They say they provide notice and resources to unsheltered residents when doing a cleanup. Livier says she hears a different story. That's not what we're hearing from community members, right? We're hearing them um, being harassed by the police, being removed, being woken up in the middle of the night, being asked uh, if they have warrants. Livier says she would like the city to build more shelter beds. She hopes a hearing date is set within the next couple of weeks. In Tucson, Faith Abercrombie, KGUN 9 on your side.